Oh, it's a nice, uh, groovy sort of sound. Yeah, FK Mesh yeah, is huge, no, man. No, 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 he does the things. Bangers on bangers. He does the things. So we're hanging out with Ntati Moshesh and uh, people like Ntati Moshesh. You don't introduce by reading out their bio. No, you don't do silly things like that. You just come out here and say, yes. ladies and gentlemen, Ntati Moshesh. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. How are you, madam? She's good. She's good. This madam, she's good. She's she's good. She's idling. She's loving it. She's yeah. taking it easy. That's good. Yeah. She's bonding with her son who's on holiday from varsity and just Oh loving beautiful. It. Beautiful. You yeah. in a good space? I'm in an amazing space. Emotionally, mentally, spiritually. Uh, or always. Spiritually could be better. Uh-huh. Spiritually could be better. I think there's a Where's the sluggishness mm, coming from? I think we under attack. Oh, is it? There's a spiritual attack that's Whoa. happening. Yes. I think so too. There's a there's a serious spiritual attack and it's coming and it's like missiles are being thrown left, right and center. So you've got to be spiritually um, armored. What yeah. do you mean? What if I say I don't feel it? What What are you talking about? Spiritual attacks? Um, I think, I suppose mental health is one of them. Oh. Yeah, because yeah, your yeah. mental health is yeah, yeah. linked to your spirit. It's linked yes. to your soul. Yes. So there's a lot of healing that this country has never, ever gone through. Yeah. There's a debriefing that was supposed to happen after 1994 that didn't happen. So we're living in a country that is so volatile. You're even scared to to like step on someone's toes because you don't know the rage uh, level of that yeah. person. Yeah. Mm. And and you feel it. It's so yeah. palpable. The 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 anger and the, it's the frustration the and the frustration and, and people and the fact that um you know there's a national shutdown tomorrow and mm-hmm. I'm not surprised because the the cost of living is so high. I've cut out meat completely from my diet because I cannot afford it. It's wild eh? Because you can't yeah. afford, not for health reasons. And well, health reasons. There's both. a health benefit. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes, yeah. yes. But I remember my mom, uh, very early on, she used to say, Harijanama, twice a week, it's it's a lot. And oh, that was not even because we couldn't afford it, it's because of health reasons. Mm. You steam your vegetables. Yes. In fact, you grow your vegetables. Yeah, start there. Because sometimes they say organic uh, vegetables, and they're not quite organic. Mm. Unless you're growing them with your own hands. Yeah, and you can yeah. see that there's mm. nothing that pesticides or fit mm. or whatever is going. Yes. Do you feel different? Do you feel healthier now that you've cut out meat and for how long has it been? Oh, you feel lighter. Mm. Wow. Yes. Mm. As someone as someone put it the one time, he says, you're taking on the energy of the animal when you eat the animal. That's so, true. So, so if, if a bull is angry or it's frustrated, you're taking on... That and is you, so wild. You, and you're ingesting that. That is so, so wild. So you're eating what the animal's going through. That Sound, is so wild. I've never like, thought of it that way. Yeah. So, so that's a spiritual thing I'm talking about as well, is that is that animals have spirits. Yes. yes. And a lot of them, when they do get slaughtered, it's a moment of trauma oh. and the muscles, there's a muscle yes, memory. Yes. Yeah. It sounds like you watched What the Health, the documentary. No. It's exactly about that. No. Is it? No. Called, it's called What the Health. Where is yeah. it on? I've heard the documentary. On Netflix. Oh, is it on Netflix? Yeah. What the Health. I'm going to check it out. I'm yeah. going to check it out. Yeah. Ladies and gents, she's been a consistent excellent and exceptional force in the television and film space like forever and a day forever and a day i know this for a fact been fanning forever and a day as she's done productions like saint and sinners that's what comes to mind right beat the drums Mm. savage beauty yes 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 the netflix i've been saying savage all along oh savage savage beauty savage beauty (laughs) Mm. merci beaucoup Mm. Oh. Yes. <laughs> or, or, you, or you can Africanize and say, like savage beauty. Yeah, savage, hey. savage beauty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and who can forget your role on lockdown? I mean, you've done a lot. I have done a lot. You've done a hell of a lot. Uh, Theatre as well. Yes, I'm going to watch Ruined um, very soon. Yeah. And, and I always get jealous. Yeah. And, and je- but jealous in a good way. Like I, mm. I, when you watch other actors on stage, it's like. Oh, I know that adrenaline when when the butterflies are running it when you backstage and you you come out and there's an audience and they're looking at you mm-hmm. and you feed off that energy. Yeah. Mm. And 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 for me then I would miss my father because my dad would sit there and and I always think please can I not catch my dad's eye because I know I'll be thrown completely off. Wow. Mm. So I used to pray about that every time when it's opening night I would yeah. pray that please don't tell me where my parents are sitting. 
because my dad's quite vocal. So it's like, hey, can we have a knockout? Oh, super dad. He was that dad. Was that dad. Yes. Was that. So, so I always used to pray. And the one and the one time, um, oh, Nothing But The Truth. I was doing Nothing But The Truth with Brad John Kani and the fabulous Pam Nomvete. Yeah. And mm-hmm. I took a bow. And as I bowed, my eyes, as I stood up, my eyes met my father's. And you were thrown. No, because it was, it was the end. end. No, it was the end. end. But, and so, so yeah. then I was filled with like, oh, my dad's here. Oh, sweet. So it was a lovely feeling, but I'm glad I didn't catch his eye before. So How? tell me, quick fast. Um, yeah. We were talking about money earlier. Yes. Are you a borrower or a lender? I'm a lender, sadly. You lend money? Yes. Mm, um, why? I remember the one time I joined a stock fell and when it was my turn, people were coming up with excuses. And I think it took the one person like 10 years to pay me. Oh, and you see, you see why I don't do it? It was 5,000 rand. Do you see, what I, see why I don't do it? Yeah. No, Tell I'm me a what lender. your problem is. I'm but a lender. Surely they will go through a lot then if they're going to pay five grand over 10 years. Actually, also, that, you can that understand was, that. There was two people who owed me five. I don't know what it is about five thousand. I'm always owed five thousand. <laughs> <laughs> Except the production houses don't owe you five thousand. <laughs> this is called Sad Day. Ko Young Stunner and Blackie. Y'all Ko dropped. Zero Yesterday, KO. yo, that diss track. The response to the diss track, guys. Listen, it's a Wangabi Nation. There's going down. Hey, you pick Zulu. And the first person to respond is KO. Duncan promised to respond because he also took a heavy shot in that diss track. Yeah. But KO murdered a, 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 a big Zulu. Yeah, no, no. KO Did completely slaughtered him. Omega Freestyle, it's called. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful. I like the artwork, actually. <laughs> Sandals in, but that's yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. I love the artwork. So do you listen to hip-hop? Do you know what we're talking about? Are yeah. you in the know? I'm, I'm completely... I'm, I'm a little bit lost, but because of my son, who's turning 21 next year, I have to kind of keep up. So you know who so K.O. I'm not, is? Oh, no, I do know Do you know who Big Zulu is? I love Big Zulu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you love Big Zulu? Oh, I love Big Zulu. Ah, she likes Tangabis, this one, eh? Yeah, yeah. No, no, ah, no, Big Zulu, like... no. Big Zulu is some... And, and I love his... The fact that he's so authentic. Absolutely. He's so unapologetic about who he is, yeah. about being Zulu, mm. and he doesn't care, what, you know, what you say. Yeah, he's got his dreads. He's got yeah, no, no, the you brand definitely, would. yeah, the brand would. You know, definitely know Big Zulu. <laughs> That's Big Zulu. <laughs> That's Big Zulu. Brand would. So when you started in the film space, obviously, I mean, we all start things with the hope, and I think the intention uh, for it to last long. But uh, do you think? Would you say your career has surprised you? Did you intend to be? a long-lasting like star in this game no i did i did I, so when i had that conversation with my father you know the career yeah so young lady what do you intend to do with the rest of your life and i said uh acting he says you know it's it's a tricky space you know it's not there's no security there's no and he says if you can look me in the eye and tell me honestly this is what you want what you want to do with for the rest of your life then i give you my go ahead and that's exactly what happened. Yeah. And you've done it so well. I mean, the longevity, yeah, consistency, consistency mm. clean brand. We don't even know a lot about you, you know, personally. Oh, I got some skeletons in my cab. Oh, you got, you got some scandals. Oh, you got yeah. some scandals. We all have some scandals in my cab. You're doing a story <laughs> job keeping it under wraps. Wow. <laughs> like how, what would you say, you know, attributed towards that? Is it how you've treated, you know, your, your craft the game, the industry, did you show it respect and it reciprocated that? I think it's also when we started. Remember, I started back in the, would have been the early 90s. Mm. So so there was there was a discipline that was unparalleled. And I think because we started with theatre, there's something about theatre trained actors. True. And which, which you cannot take away from them. And, and we can almost spot each other even on sets. You can see an actor who has been theatre trained at some stage. There's, there's, a, there's just a mindset. That is so true. That is, the likes of Silo Makagangube, Pamela Nomvete, yes. the discipline yes. and the longevity. Mm. Yes. Wow. Yes. Mm. Because there's, there's an approach to it. It's, it's, you treat it as a craft. Remember, we didn't get into it to be famous. We got into it because we loved storytelling. We, lo- we got into it because like we liked wow. the... Uh, being a chameleon the fact that yeah. I, I, I once played a man and I loved that role I would actually in I what, wouldn't mind playing that w- again was, was this in what production was no this? I was still studying you I think still it was, studying, it was yeah. in my third year yeah and I remember loving the process yeah. of learning how to sit like a man speak like a man the whole body language and and that's what it is it's it's the craft 
of acting that that a lot of us went into acting for yeah and we never lose sight of that I love that you're taking us back to young you when you were still in school. The people that held your hand, maybe some of them aren't around, but can you can you name them? Yes, I can. Uh, Verity uh-huh. Davidson, she's living in um, New Zealand. Mm-hmm. We're friends on Facebook. Thank you so much because you introduced me to drama. Frances Cox, she was my drama teacher as well. Thank you so much, Frances. My headmaster, the late headmaster, is the one who called my father into his office because I studied music. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm. Great uh, at Standard Seven. Mm-hmm. Then end of Standard Seven, called my father into his office and said, um, "Mr. Mashesh, I really believe your daughter will be better at drama, at than, drama. Uh, and, than music because I played the piano, but I, I really sucked. I was terrible." Oh. <laughs> wow. And and so so my headmaster is the one that actually started this journey for me by convincing my father to allow me to switch from music to, to drama. drama. Wow. Speaking of like people who you know inspired you. I know. I, I read an interview. You said Patrick Shire was like your, one of your favorite yes. actors. How did you oh, take really that was. loss, and how was your guys' relationship? I think. I think that we we're still gonna feel his loss. Yeah, of course. Because Patrick was a committed thespian. There was still. Mm. A, he he's one of those actors who would have acted until, uh, you know, on his deathbed. Well, well until the wheels. Yeah, off, right? yeah, yeah. He was. Yeah. He, he he loved acting with. It was about the craft for him. He was never shy too. And and if you saw Patrick Shy on stage, he was on another level. He did the suit, and he just blew you away. Oh, but yeah, yeah, yeah. The suit, the suit, the suit oh. was something else. The suit was something else. Can't, can't, can't ever measure it against anything else. No. In its own field of perfection, there. Um, um, uh, Silomaki also did it as well. Yeah. Siabonga Twala did it as well. Yeah. Maybe Ntati will did it as well. Hey, yeah, you never know. Oh, yeah, that, you, you know. wow, that would be an amazing the spin. Suit. The suit. Oh, oh. On the streets, on the air, 959 Breakfast. It is 10 after 7. We're still hanging out with Ntati Mushesh. So, um, hmm. I love the song, by the way. Yeah, yeah, it's a very yeah, nice song. I love yeah, it. I dig I'm this glad. song. I love it. I'm glad we're playing you music that you're enjoying. Yes. Yeah. I mean, no, imagine. I, I, I think I, I enjoy all music, to yeah, be honest. Yeah. You do, you do. Yeah, yeah, I do. When I was your niece, we were talking about this, that triple threat of a human being. Dances, sings, acts. Netballs. Plays netball. Oh, plays netball. Legs, yeah. for days. Legs for days. Right. And just such a superhuman being. She's a beautiful woman. Yeah, she's gorgeous. Her and my late brother were like... Oh, she would say Uncle Jay and then oh. they just had an amazing bond. Oh. Yeah. I love watching human beings that come from a bloodline of sheer talent. Of just brilliance, yeah. Your brilliance. Except we're the only two. Oh, Isn't is that it? interesting? Yes, we don't we, we don't come from a family of of creatives. If if you if we both have to look at our bloodline, no, it's we're just probably both the both of you. Only two, really. Wow. Oh, and no, how can I forget Mastaba Mushesh? No, Mastaba as well. You see, come on now. But that's only three. Well, then you just need three of enough of no, that I'm talent. No, I'm lying. I'm lying. There's a there's a nephew who's a, a designer. Oh, there we you go. You see, now they're coming. Okay. Now they're coming. How see, do you say line. the surname? Did you just say Mushesh? I heard wrong because I always I'm very shy in saying your it's surname because I can. Both. Wow. Mushesh, if Mushesh. you're saying Tati Mushesh, I'll, I'll accept it. Also Mushesh, Mushesh. Same. Yeah. There's wow. a there's a history. There's a history behind the surname. And I wow. like that you asked that. Yeah. What's I think the that's history? Like, how did it? I did become... a whole documentary on that history. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's called Who Do You Think You Are? Who do you think Who you, do you are? Do you yeah. think you Where can are? you catch it? Um, or it just aired. It, it was um a it was BBC, on but SABC has yeah, was all, I, I remember seeing SABC. So yeah. I, they, they, I was the first one who was featured. Wow, man! Yeah, so they, I so that. they, they just trace your lineage. Wow! Yeah, yeah. Mishesh, Mishesh, and, and Mishesh, I got Mishesh. to hear. I never knew that. Yeah. yeah. So don't forget that on the third of September, all things are going down at uh, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Ntati, you're invited with the family. Now you must bring the family. Uh, what's happening is that uh, Kaya nine five nine is celebrating his twenty fifth birthday turning 25 this year. I'm so not missing that. Yeah, no, you can't. No, absolutely you can't. Amazing lineup. Oh. Bring kids. I want people to bring kids. Mm. Beautiful play zone there for the kids. He's 21. Almost 21. Can it's I bring fine. Him? Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm sure him. he jams to six, but do any. And he's gorgeous. And he's gorgeous. Oh. Well, you know, he's... Are we allowed to say that about our kids? Yes, yes, yes you are. You, you are. You are, absolutely. No. My, my son is drop-dead gorgeous. 
Beautiful. We love this. Bring him so we can see him. Remove it, Rona. Remove it, Richego. Or what? What just a ganang ganang? It's a good thing he's sleeping because otherwise, when I get home, he's like, "Yo, mom, oh. don't do those things." You know, because I always constantly embarrass him. <laughs> <laughs> so it's going to be at the Wondrous Stadium, right? Uh, for you, uh, tickets are 150 buck for adults and 100 rand for kids, right? So you know, uh, from uh, what time are we there? Yo, we there from like about 10. From, from 10 yeah, up until 6. 10. Yeah, crazy lineup. Yeah. Um, um, Bugalav is there. Tebe is Bandini, there. Zex Bandini. Kulichana. Yes. Ami Faku We're going to be there. Talking, We're going to be there about playing. Bugalav, Mashelling is one of my favorite songs ever. So you're also quite ahead. If, if you want to if you wanna make my day, play my shilling and it used to lift my mood. I'll be driving and I'll just hear my shilling. We have to and find it. And you can it, imagine, Chris. there you are, the robot... Yo, I, I love your taste. Oh, goodness. Huh? And you're you're such a, hit. Yeah, and you're such a young energy because like, yeah. one of my favorite characters <laughs> of you is from Isor, no? You know what I mean? And you've got this Maybe beautiful so. young energy. Yeah. And they also tend to give you this young Ben 10 in your all roles. All the time. All the it time. Was, it was that, only that role, not all the time, not really. No, not all but the time. Can, I get that energy from you. Are you into Ben 10s though? Are oh, you into no. younger guys? No, no, I'm an ageist. Are oh, you an ageist? Yeah. Yeah. In fact, I prefer Sabo Papa Baron. Kind of five years older. Five years older. Yeah. Oh, okay. So you've never I gone younger. I dated someone three years younger, and it bothered me. And well, what, what and is there was it about no it? It's it's an age thing. Like I said, I really am an ageist. Yeah. Wow, it, okay. it bothered me that I think I turned forty. He was thirty-seven, and I was like, no, no, not You're wrong. Not the one. He's still writing three. Nothing yeah. all for. Uh-uh. But yeah. wasn't he matching you? Like I mean, oh, no, psychologically. We, oh no, we were completely Every... compatible. But it but it bothered me. Whoa. And as a result, yeah. Ish. So I want to give you this to read for us. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. I just handed her a piece of paper. You'll see this on kai959.co.za. All right? Because we listen and watch her. Okay? We do the things that make the things for the eyes and the ears to work simultaneously at the same time. So, 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 um, you're very well spoken. Mm. Okay? Literally, we could all use your voice. Very soothing yoga style for our voicemails. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. And, uh... Have you ever considered a career in like animation, voiceover, artistry? Those I would sorts love of that. Arts? I would love that. Okay. I love animation. Okay, fantastic. So here's 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 we're gonna put your bedroom voice to the test. Okay. Okay. Yes. You're gonna please read that for us. Now I just fell in love, and I just quit my job. I'm gonna find you drive. Damn, they work me so damn hard. Work by nine, then off past five. And they work my nerves. That's why I cannot sleep at night. You can break my soul. Break. Yeah. You can break my soul. Yeah, Everybody. Yeah, yeah. Everybody. Everybody. Yeah. You can break my soul. Don't leave me hanging. Uh, give me a, a, if a, I was a, that 37 a, year old, I'd thing. never want to leave the bedroom. Yeah, that damn, they work me so damn hard. Girl. Girl. Mm. Hell, wait, that bedroom voice. Wait away, make a woman blush. <laughs> listen I'm to blushing. Yourself. Yes, listen to yourself. Should I read it again? Oh yeah. my gosh, no, yes. Just that damn, they work me so damn hard. Oh, break my soul. Oh, it's from break my soul. Yes, wow. it is, huh? No, Interesting, huh? Has, wow. Sounds different when you read it, eh? Yeah. Yeah. But lyric, 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 lyricists, I take my hat off because it's not easy to come up with where well, it's not just one word, Zokshai and Zokshai and Zokshai. No. Where it's. <laughs> Where the hell did that stem from? <laughs> but, uh, no. I shy, I shy, yeah. shy. <laughs> but the whole song. See, that's why she's not a lyricist. Yeah. That's, that's, why. Why. that's all you know. One shy, word. Shy, shy. <laughs> but, uh, but I've been listening to Michael yeah. Jackson's um, lyrics, and yeah. he that that he, man he. that man was something else. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Michael Jackson was just on another level. Yeah. Speaking of creating, do you see yourself going behind the scenes, being a producer, creating, directing, not writing? A, not at all. So I love just performing. I just love taking on a character. Because mm. one day I could play um, a DJ or. A, Broadcaster, and I'll remember what Saul did. I'll remember what Dineo did. Mm -hmm. Because wow. it's all about observation. Yeah. I'll see um, what her job is. What you know, Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So, so I, because I'm an observer of life, I would, I would feel like I'm missing out if I'm behind the scenes. Yeah. I like that you know what you want to do and what you don't want to do. Because I think a lot of people 
a lot of people don't know what they don't want to do. They want to do it all to a point where they don't know what they don't want to do. Where you almost don't master anything. Yeah, yeah jack of all so, trades. So I've always wanted to master acting. Do you know that that saying is incomplete? Jack of all trades, master, master of, of none. none. It is incomplete and it's used so incorrectly. Wow. Jack of all okay. trades, master of none, but it's better to master what? I'm going to find it. Master yeah. one. It's better to that master rhymes. all... To master some than none, I think along those lines, but I'm going to find yeah, it. Yeah. I'm going to find it. Bitch, I, I, I get what you mean. So I'm about mastering a craft or yeah. a skill. or So I take my hats off to people like uh, plumbers and electricians because that's that's what they do. So everything yeah. about electricity turns them on. Mm-hmm. Everything ah, about turns acting, them on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. See what you did there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so everything about acting turns me on. I watch, I'm a voracious film uh, fundi yeah, I don't call myself that because I, I I used to have a, a stack of like a thousand videos and yeah. I would if I need reference for a role I would I knew which video I put on to I watch, watch which yeah. scene I record I rewind I write yeah. notes and I'm still doing that to this day gonna have to let you go gonna have to say thank you very much for joining us oh I've had so oh. much fun yeah it was fun it was so absolutely short, fun yeah, thank you so, fun. very short very short thank you very much for starting your day on 959 with us so back to Munewa Yes. Are you the go-to aunt? I Does would like. I would like to be. I've, I've, I've she reached, opens I've up reached, to you. I've reached out to her. Um, we're going to talk about it. We haven't met yet. I've yeah. spoken to her mom though. Yeah, about so, what she's going through yes, right now. And, I'm, uh, and I know the, the the young man. Yeah. That she's talking about. Yeah. I met him. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I know his mom. Yeah. Yeah. So you would say she? You you are a safe space for her. Yes, within no, no, the family. I am a, no, I am a safe space. Well, I'm glad to know that it's, she it's has It's a pity my, my, my brother is not here because my brother definitely would have been the person that she calls and he would have given her sage advice. Yeah. Mm. Because I think it's very tricky to talk about it right now because it's of ongoing. Of course, of course. Mm-hmm. But of she's course. got my support. She knows she's got my support. I've even, um, I reached out to her on Instagram as well and I reached out to her via WhatsApp have you, as well. Have you experienced any form of abuse in a romantic relationship ever? I have. That's, to a, come story, out that's of it, right? a story to, for another day. I was young, uh, still in Katlehong, yeah. and he was abusive. And I remember the day he passed on. I not celebrated, but I, but I'll be honest, I felt relieved. Yes, I relieved because I felt like he he was um, he terrorized sure uh, women. Yeah, so I've been at the. Yeah. On the receiving end of that. Well, I'm glad she has you. I really am glad she has you. Thank mm. you so much, Ntati. No, thank, thank you. you. Love you. Respect and you so much. And, and uh, a shout out to Tandi Matlaila. It's your birthday today. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Oh, Tandi Matlaila. To the camera, we say thank you for watching. Catch it on 959, kai959.co.za. We love you. Thank you so thank much. You, my yeah.